the Service Employees International Union has about 350 people working at extended care homes in Regina. The Parkside location is currently experiencing a growing outbreak. As of Friday, 90 residents and 45 staff members have tested positive for COVID-19. Now the union says that there have been ongoing problems. CBC spoke to Barbara Cape, president of SEIU West. She says for a long time, staff were not provided the proper PPE or resources. This is everything from proper masks to enough people working at the home. Still, she says extended care managers are doing their best, but that more action needs to be done by the Ministry of Health. We are, you know, nine, ten months into a pandemic, and only now are those resources being put forward to extended care who are experiencing, quite frankly, a, an unbelievable outbreak. In a written statement, extended care says staff are provided with all the personal protective equipment they need. They say teams are supported and given PPE training as well. Health Minister Paul Merriman says the government is doing spot audits of homes. So this is very concerning on multiple levels. Obviously, the health of the individuals is the first and foremost. Uh, but what we've done uh, with the SHA has been able to pull people out of other areas of our health care system and move them in there to be able to support. Cape says she's concerned the outbreak has not yet plateaued at the home. Heidi Adder, CBC News, Regina.